for tuning in. Now, before we move on, there's still two more orders of business that need to be taken care of. First is to show you all this picture of a yak. And second is to play one of our favorite games. It's time for Wax On! Wax Off! Welcome to Wax On! Wax Off, the trivia game where for every correct answer, you get $100. And for every incorrect answer, you get a portion of your chest hair waxed off. <laughs> Let's meet tonight's lucky contestant. Come on in, buddy. <laughs> got a lot, you got a lot to work with here. Uh, very good. What is, what is your name and where are you from? Mike. I'm from Canada, but I live in Boston now. Hey, cool. All right, I like both of those places. Uh, very good. Now, you know the rules. I'll ask you a series of questions. If you get it wrong, Courtney here will apply hot wax to your chest and then violently rip out a strip of your hair. <laughs> now, there is one twist. You don't get to answer the questions. You're gonna have to rely on a little help from your friend. Let's bring him out. Come on over, buddy. <laughs> what is your name and where are you from? My name is Raj. I'm from Austin, Texas, but now I live in the city. Hey, very good. All right, now, how, how do you know this man, Raj? Craigslist roommates in Austin. True story. <laughs> Didn't know there was music to that, but now there is. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, you're Craigslist coming music? Craigslist uh, music in Austin. I, and if it doesn't, you don't do it. No, yeah, okay, good. Yeah, right, very good. Well, look, his fate rests entirely in your hands. How are you at trivia? I don't know. We'll find out. <laughs> so, hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Very good. Here we go. Best of luck. Remember, it's very easy. Just answer correctly, and your friend doesn't have to get his chest waxed. Simple enough, right? Let's take a look at tonight's categories. Here we go. Russian land treaties, <laughs> the Peloponnesian War, did somebody say astro-seismology? <laughs> now you'll notice that astro-seismology is in quotes. <laughs> Moving on, 437 BC, other lesser-known Russian land treaties, <laughs> and of course, potpourri. <laughs> You have to stop laughing. You're a very giddy <laughs> laugh right now. Uh, are you feeling good about these categories? Uh, just try your best, Raj. Okay, here we go. <laughs> let's, let's get started. As per the rules of the game, I will be choosing the categories for you. <laughs> so let's start it off with Russian land treaties. Ready? Here we go. In the Treaty of San Stefano, following the Russo-Turkish War of 1877, the Ottoman Empire ceded Batum, Alti, Bayezid, and these two Caucasus territories to Russia. Um, Shh. Audience, no helping. <laughs> what is, uh, what is Rasputin Island? <laughs> so sorry, we're looking for Artahan and Artveen. It's Artahan and Artveen, very famous territories, and you don't have to put it in the form of a question, so uh -huh. give him an extra rip on that one. <laughs> Courtney, Courtney, get on in there. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be just fine. <laughs> It's gonna be just fine. And rip! Do. Oh. <laughs> all right, all right. Rocky start. But you can make up for it on the next question. Let's see, I'm gonna choose the Peloponnesian War. Let's take a look at the question. In the famous Battle of Notium, Lysander was able to lead the Spartans to victory largely because Alci <laughs> Alcibiades left this helmsman in control of the Athenian fleet. Ah. Don't, don't overthink it. Troy. Is that person? So Boys. sorry. We were looking for Antiochus. <laughs> Antiochus. Okay, Courtney, wax that chest. <laughs> Fine. Is it hot? Yeah, it's hot wax. Yeah, yeah. Very, very good. All right. Get it on there real good. All right, Courtney, ready? Rip it! No. Yeah, high five for the Yeah. Kind of looks like a little thing there. You're trying to get in like a kind of a, like a heart almost. Very nice. Uh, okay, you're 0 for 2 so far. You know. You know what that sound means? It's time for double trouble. 
I'll ask you a question, you answer correctly, you win a whopping 200 bucks. But answer incorrectly, and your friend gets two strips of chest hair waxed off. All right. You ready? Yes. Okay, the category is a very easy one. It is... Numbers! Here's the question. I'm thinking of a number between one and one thousand. <laughs> I'm thinking of a number between one and one thousand. What is the number? 223. 223, okay. 223, your answer is locked in. However, since this is double trouble, you may be having second thoughts. So I'm going to go offer you a second chance, a chance to change your answer if you want. Uh, so once in a lifetime opportunity, I strongly suggest you take it. What will you be changing your answer to? Ah, uh, 369. Sorry, it was actually 223. You were right. <laughs> Should have stuck with your gut on that one. Should have stuck with your gut. <laughs> Courtney, wax that chest twice. Oh, yeah, right down the center there. That's not going to feel good. That's not going to feel good at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at this one. It's coming up right underneath, yeah. Yeah, that's a great one there. That was thick. Now right, here we go. Rip number one. No. Let's rip number two. Get in. Rip. Sorry about that false alarm there. <laughs> oh, sadly, we only have time for one more clue. Uh, you've played violently so far, but you haven't won any cash, and your friend has had half his chest hair ripped off. So this is your chance to make up for that. The remaining categories are, did somebody say astro seismology, 437 BC, other lesser-known Russian land treaties, and potpourri. You know what? I'm going to go easy on you, and let's just select potpourri, okay? Here we go. Remember, this could be any category. Let's see what tonight's potpourri category is. Hey! Lucky break! <laughs> you almost had to answer a TV or movies question. That would, that would be tough. Here we go. This is for all the marble slash chest hair. Let's see the clue. Following the end of the Ingrian War, Sweden gained the Russian province of Kexholm in 1617 treaty. It's an easy one. <laughs> Um, the Treaty of 1617. Sorry, we're looking for the Treaty of Stolbovo. Wow. Treaty of Stolbovo. Okay, once more, let's wax that chest. Uh, oh. Hand is Steve, what will they be taking home? Well, Jimmy, they'll each be taking home these stylish Led Zeppelin t-shirts where the L fell off, as well as this 24-pack of Nads brand hair removal strips to finish the job. Go Nads! Jimmy! Thank you so much, Steve. There you go. Thank you so much. How you doing, buddy? Uh, good. You know, I got a few problems, but I'd love to talk about it after the show. <laughs> Enjoy those prizes, everybody. Thank you for playing Wax On, Wax Off! We'll be right back with Randy Jackson!